How does the X drive slash holonomic base work? By 7700Y. Holonomic drive base. Holonomic drive is the ability for a vehicle to move in all directions and rotate independently. For example, a tank, which has to rotate before it can move in a different direction, which would not be holonomic. Okay, so a tank drive versus a holonomic drive base. So for a tank drive, it can go forward, backward, turn right, turn left, but it can't go side to side. And that's where the holonomic drive base comes in. For the holonomic drive base, it can go side to side, go forward, backward, turn right, turn left. It's very maneuverable and it's very fast. Whereas a tank drive is not as maneuverable, but it has more torque, meaning it's has more strength, it's stronger, whereas a holonomic drive base is not as strong because it's maneuverable. Holonomic drive advantages and disadvantages. For advantages, you can turn faster, move in any direction, and have a good turning radius. It's also a very sturdy design. But for disadvantages, it's harder to code, you need to do CAD, which is a lot of work, and if you build the robot slightly off, it won't drive straight. Using the holonomic drive base for driving instead of tank drive. The X drive base helps when strafing. The strafing helps in moving left and right for aligning. The controls were simpler than tank drive, but the code was more complicated. The tank drive is less precise, but has more torque. They both have their strengths and weaknesses, but overall the X drive is more reliable. Okay, so coding a holonomic drive base. So because the holonomic drive base has four different wheels and they're all going in different directions, it's very important to take that into consideration when coding. And all of these four wheels are at 45 degree angles. And like a tank drive, not only can this holonomic drive base go forward and backward, it can also go side to side. And in order to code that, when going to side to side, the front two motors will spin inwards and the back two motors will spin outwards and vice versa for both sides. Controls with the holonomic drive. The left stick controls the movement forward, backward, and strafing. The right stick only affects the turning of the robot and to change the angle of the robot. This can make driving smoother and less time in between simple movements, saving time and maximizing efficiency. So here are our credits and resources we used. And thank you for listening.